What's up guys, Laidback Gaming here, bringing you the top 10 of November. This is going to be number uh, 6 through 10. Uh, number 10, we have Hot Wheels. I'm not even going to pronounce the second name because it's just weird. Um, anyway, it's made by Suicide Winner. Um, he always comes up with these weird names. Uh, you know, I don't know exactly why, but he's always got, you know, uh, these weird, like, Chinese, Japanese, Japanese type names uh, for, you know, most of his tracks. Um, so, I mean, it's, it's pretty interesting looking at his, uh, some of his tracks and his file share. Uh, but here he's got a little, uh, cool little 180 flip, front flip type, uh, type jump, which is really cool and unique. I really like that. Um, and this, uh, this is just a really cool map. He always does a good job. Like, the past two maps that have made it, um, the other map that made it was called Ninja Coaster. Uh, that was a month ago, a month or two ago, and that was a really cool map as well. And I just love the way he makes maps. Like, um, you know, they might not, so at some points, you know, they might not have the most smoothest turns or something like that, but he's just so unique in what he makes, you know. Um, you know, any aesthetic pieces he puts around his map or, you know, makes a part of his map is just, you know, pretty cool. Uh, I did kind of mess up on this jump right here, and then I kind of got blocked by this rock and just, I was going, I don't know why it took me forever to get out of the way. But um, anyway, yeah, so it's just, like, I really enjoyed his map. It's not, it's not a, like, really long map. Uh, it's about, you know, like a minute, ten seconds. Um, but it's just a really fun map, and, uh, you know, definitely go download it. It's really cool and unique. I love the features he put into it. You know, all the stuff he did with it was awesome. Uh, but number nine, we have Tectonic by uh, Jur, W13, I guess. Jur, uh, that's a cool name. Um, so, yeah, this is a double-wide map. Um, it's pretty cool. It's got, you know, you saw those uh, in the overview, the, the uh, little rock aesthetic places, and it's got some cool jumps here. Also, guys, if you haven't noticed, the game is a little bit laggy. Um, I don't know if you haven't been able to notice yet, but there's people just lagging all over the place. Um, this this race might not be a good example of it, but there is a lot of there was a lot of lag when we were playing the open party because, I mean, we had 12 people, which is you know a fairly good amount of people, and I didn't figure it was gonna lag, but it lagged pretty bad, um, and I didn't really you know uh, I mean I, I'm not gonna like redo the race, so I just kind of <laughs> threw it in there. Um, <clears throat> but this is a cool map. It's smooth. Uh, it's got a couple jumps in there. Uh, there's already been, you know, like three different jumps in the map. And then it's got some jumps into these uh, rocks, which is really cool. He's got some red lights in these rocks. And you end up taking um, taking this left turn and, you know, going right back under under into the rocks and all this other stuff. So, you know, he, he had added some cool features there. And it's, uh, you know, it's a little bit longer than you think. You would th if, Just from the overview, um, in my opinion, it doesn't look as long as uh, you would think it would be. Um, but, again, it's about a minute, 10 seconds. Uh, the ending could have been a little bit better, I think. Uh, well, I mean, not the ending, but the landing or just a second ago. And then the jump. Uh, the jump doesn't always work, which is, I mean, a bit of a problem. It's it's not, like, always accurate, as you saw. The two people in front of me did not make the jump. Um, so there's a couple things he could have worked on, but, you know, all in all, it's a good map, and I really enjoyed it. Um, at number eight, we have Restless by XX Womp XX. Um, he, I honestly don't think he's ever been in the uh, in the top ten. I don't think Jer W thirteen has either. So it's two unknown forgers we have in the top ten. Womp is a little bit more known, but he really hasn't. I'm I'm pretty sure he hasn't been in the top ten yet. So this is good, you know, um, to get him out here on the top ten. And I'm racing by myself in this one. Uh, I, I'm I think it's because I can't remember exactly why. I'm pretty sure something messed up, and I was trying to. Uh, I guess I didn't save the race that we had with with a bunch of people. Either that, or I just didn't finish it. I can't remember. So I, you know, I just raced it by myself, and uh, there was a couple times where I actually thought I was going to fall off. So it's good that I didn't fall off. Um, and it sucked because at the very end it lags kind of, so you don't really get to see me like there's like a jump at the end, so you don't really get to see me do that jump because I accidentally hit something and do a barrel roll and like perfectly landed. I just thought it was the coolest thing, but you don't get to see it, um, which kind of sucks. But anyway, this is a, this is a roller coaster, uh, the first roller coaster. So well. I'm stupid. Um, the second one, uh, Hot Wheels, was of course, of course, a roller coaster. Uh, but yeah, Womp is like a really—he's a really great forger. You know, he came out of nowhere. Really, I didn't really know much about him, and he uh, submitted a couple maps. He submitted a map called Hey Yeah, and that was in the voting video. Of course, it didn't make it. Sadly, I wish it would have because it was a great map. But yeah, he just came out of nowhere, and he's just a really great forger. Um, I don't know if he makes any double wides. I just know he makes roller coasters, and you know he does a really great job with them. So definitely go download him, go check out his maps and his file share because he really does a good job with all of his maps that he makes. Um, and in number seven, we have Retro Version by CEGX Cryptic. A lot of people know who he is. He's getting more, you know, well known. Uh, I, I love this map. It's a double wide map. It's really smooth, and he's just like he's surprised me a lot. He's gotten a ton better at forging. 
uh, you know, making his tracks smooth and all that stuff and, you know, taking time on his tracks. He's done a really good job um, with all the stuff, you know, that he's done making tracks. Um, yeah, he's done, a, he's done a really good job recently making tracks, and he's really progressed and gotten a lot better. Um, the only thing that I have a problem with is just, it's my opinion, uh, I just don't like 90-degree turns like that. Um, I don't know why exactly. It's just, it's just something that I don't enjoy racing. But, uh, you know, it's still, you know, a really good map. It's still well made. And uh, there are, I think, three of the 90-degree turns or whatever in this map. So, um, I mean, so if you, if you don't like them, uh, I'm sorry. But, I mean, at some points, you know, depending on what he wanted to do with the track, he might have had to do 90-degree 90 90 turn. Um, but it's just a preference for me, at least. Uh, I just don't, I don't really, I don't recommend making 90-degree turns. I'm not saying it's bad or it makes the map any worse. Um, again, it's just my opinion. So, you know, a lot of people might like 90 degree turns. It's just, in my personal opinion, I don't enjoy them as much. Uh, but other than that, it's a really good map. It's like I said, he's gotten a lot better um, ever since you know I first started seeing him make maps and stuff like that. He's just, you know, he's he's really surprised me and, and he's gotten tons better with making his maps. You know, making everything smooth and stuff like that. Uh, so uh, he's you know he's a great forger and he's going to continue to put out some good maps. So be sure to go download his map as well. Just check out his file share. Um, <clears throat> okay, number six, we have Unverander by Jaster X. He's another guy that I don't think has been in the top ten yet, so already we have three people that have really, I don't think, ever been in the top ten. Um, and this, this map is a double wide and it's really, really spread out, as you can tell. Um, I didn't do the voting, I didn't do the voting video, but uh, K94 did the voting video, and I think this was kind of like a... He didn't really get the best overview on this, which is okay. Uh, but it's just really spread out. I was surprised. You know, I was wondering when... Because from the overview, I hadn't downloaded the map yet. And from the overview, uh, sorry, this lag is really bad here, as you can tell. Um, but from the overview, you know, I didn't see much of the track. So, and I hadn't raced yet, and a lot of people were voting for it. So I was, you know, just kind of like, hmm, I don't know about this. You know, I, I don't see, like, like it doesn't look like this is going to be the best map in the world and stuff like that. But a lot of people were voting for it, and I raced it. And sure enough, it's a really great map. Um, I like it. I love it when he goes in the caves right here, and he has these rocks that you go in, in between and stuff. Um, you know, and it's really spread out. You don't really know, like, that. This, this that's the thing about voting videos is you have to download the maps. You can't look at an overview and be like, okay, well, I don't want to vote for that map. It doesn't look good. You have to. You can't, you can't ever decide until you, there's another one of these 90 degree turns, but uh, you can't ever decide. We can't, you can't ever decide, you know, what, what placement a map should be in or if it should be in the top 10 at all unless you race it yourself because it's just so hard to tell by overviews. So that's why I suggest everybody whenever I make a uh, voting video that you download the maps. Of course, Canon 4, uh, he, we didn't have the uh, download links into the in the description um, when uh, when he made it, and that's okay. Uh, I think I forgot to mention to him to put those in there, but that's okay. Uh, but for next voting video, there's going to be download links and stuff, so be sure to check it out. And uh, again, guys, thanks a lot for watching. Uh, be sure to go download all these maps. They're all going to be in the description. This is actually a list right here, and you can go, and every single one of these maps are in the description. Also, if you want to watch the uh, top ten, number one through five, it will be out probably a day after this one. This uh, video is out, so if you want to watch that, there's going to be this annotation. Just click the annotation and bring you straight to the video. Um, again, guys, thanks a lot for watching, and uh, please be sure to you know, comment, like, favorite, all that stuff like that. And also go to my channel and subscribe if you like it. Thanks a lot, guys.